All right, I've heard from a couple people that cell tower number 166 was difficult, so I'm gonna look at that one. And I also had a suggestion from somebody the other day when I did the, you know, solve a cell tower as a puzzle challenge where I had to start with all the edge pieces first. And they said, how about another puzzle related challenge where I can only submit a word if it's connected to a previous word. So as you're putting pieces in a jigsaw puzzle, you wouldn't just probably place a piece in the middle, not connected to anything. So I thought that was interesting as well. So we're gonna do that today. So cell tower is like a word search. We're trying to use every letter in the grid in one of the words. And um, yeah, that's about it. You can look right above me there as I put in the words to see kind of how it puts them in order. It's a little unusual sometimes, but that's about it. Now I see wide here or widely. I like widely, but it could also be this E, it could also be that L. So we've got cell here. Cell is pretty good. Cell and widely. Mm. Ooh, what's going on with the double V? Look at this, we got a double V in here. Uh, so it's not gonna be DV. We could do something DEV, but then this is, yeah, I'm not sure what's going on there yet. If we do sell and widely, ooh, involve. Look at that, involve or involves. Okay, so I'm thinking sell and widely and yeah, and level. Okay, so let's do level and third. Oh, but it could be levels. We do third and involve and levels. I think it's gonna be levels and nonsense. Yep, and nonsense. Okay, so levels, third, now nonsense. Yeah, so it's not thirds. Ooh, but it could be sense with this E, so it could be thirds. All right, let's do widely. It's connected to levels, so we can do that. Widely, we can do sell. Now I'm thinking involves. And so I think deleting, deleting. Yep, so we can do sell um, involves, but which do we know? It's gotta be like this, but then which S are we using? We got third, we've got nonsense, so we need to use this S because the nonsense needs to use this S over here. So we're gonna do involves. We're gonna do deleting, which is a little bit tricky. It jumps over the V there. Deleting. This is either third or thirds, and nonsense. Oh, so it is. Oh, but yeah, yeah, yeah. it could be nonsense like this, and then it could be third. Uh, what's over here? Mascot, no. What about the fable? Fable? Fable's pretty good there, but I'm not sure what's happening. If, if, hmm, uh, yeah. Uh, we can do rain, R-E-I-G-N down here. Main, main? Remember, we can we can do nonsense this way. Noted, noted, and similar. Noted and similar are pretty good. And, I mean, mass, maybe? F-E-A? Well, if, right, and if we go, if we go this way, then we could do mass here. And then we could do... I mean, it could just be able, I guess. But then F... Yeah, I mean, fable is a really good word, but I'm not sure what's happening... with the rest of this in here. Especially if we do noted, then it's... emass. Which is not a word. A mass is a word, but not emass. You know, if we do similar down here... We're getting into some trouble over here because there aren't very many vowels. We've got S-C-R-N-G-N-T all together here. 
and somehow somehow we need to have some words that make sense <laughs> you know if you do rain then you've got this CNT which is no good oh no discount Discount! Yeah, 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 you can do discount and it jumps over the R. Okay, so we can do discount and rain. And... Then you've got this IFO over here. Ifio, ifio, if, ifio, what is going on over here then? The problem is, I know a bunch of these words over here. I know similar, noted, discount. Rain, third, nonsense, but I can't quite put any of them in because I don't know which S to use with nonsense and whether the one S goes with thirds because I can't figure out this middle part. But I can't put these other words in yet because we're doing it like a puzzle and it has to connect to a, an existing puzzle piece. So if we do rain and discount, we're using all of these. So then what would be going on over here? Yeah, that doesn't work. Oh! No, it does! It does! It's... Foreign! Foreign! Now, we still have a problem with the eye here if we do Fable. But foreign will work with discount, not rain, foreign. And then, feasible, feasible, it's feasible. It's feasible that this could be the answer. There we go, feasible, foreign, discount, similar. Um, I'm thinking noted. Now, let's see. Third nonsense and... And we need to do mass, so it is gonna be, yep, it's gonna be third and nonsense. Not thirds, because we need to have the extra S for mass. Third. And the final puzzle piece, mass right in the middle. There we go, alright. Perfect straight across. There was definitely some tricky stuff going on there with some different possibilities of what could have happened. So, and, and whenever you have like the two V's and a bunch of S's close to each other, it gets confusing. Up here with widely, there was a bunch of different ways you could do widely, so. Very tricky. So, anyways, let me know how you did with this cell tower. Be sure to like and subscribe, and I'll see you again soon with some more puzzles. Oh, wondered, wondered. Okay, so we can do, ooh, ooh, we have peaking. It could be speaking, actually. Okay, okay, so that's where the R is. Uh, so the C and the H and the Y are no good. You don't There's understand the problem? Oh. Well, I just happened to have a copy of the 2014 NCAA rulebook here. And if we turn to rule 10.1,